Hazel here. Where is Hazel? Cheekcast. Now I'm here. Where's Lily? How are you doing? Hi. How are you? I'm pretty good. I'm pretty good. Now, you're you, you're a streamer, right? I am. Like, uh, how long have you been doing that so far? Um, I've been doing it on and off for about I want to say three years, maybe. Uh, three years, that's pretty good. That's pretty. That's really, that's, that's dedication right there. Because I always say this, because I say dedication, because the fact is, a lot of people, they get stuck within a couple of months. They're like, um, they they get to the point where they're like, oh, I don't I don't got all the cool equipment. Oh, I don't, I need this and that. No, they don't need that. Yeah, I just, I just do it whenever I'm available to do it, and I feel like. Yeah, exactly, and do it, and th that, that's the way it should be, and the. And the fact, um, fact is, okay, so, um, what are, what is, uh, the, the type of, uh, I'll say, ask, ask, I forgot to ask, ask you this before, but I'll say, okay, so my audience knows, where are you gaming from? I am gaming from Chicago, Illinois. Just so you people, just so you people know, she's from Chicago, trust me, I'm Canada, I got a long phone, I got a long phone line, trust me, I, I hate my phone bill, so please, please, please back off phone companies, anyways, but yes, um, so, um, so, um, what, oh, what do you like to like, what do you like to game on your Twitch? Um, I mostly just stream either World of Warcraft or occasionally Heroes of the Storm, but mainly World of Warcraft is what I stream. Okay. And I also stream my artwork as well. Oh, you do artwork! Nice, nice. So, um, like uh, for uh, for your artwork, like uh, like have you has it been a lot of practice or have you? When did you just start doing getting into art? Um, I started getting into art when I was like 15 years old, and I finally decided that I would go into an art career, and I went to art college and all that, and I've just kind of stuck with it. Yeah, yeah, and I'll say like, was it more like a screw up many, many, many times, and then you slowly oh, get better? Yes, yes. <laughs> so you make a lot of errors before you start getting better, and it, like it's like I say to people, it's taken me. 15 plus years to get where I'm at now. Everyone, ha but I heard this because all, all my friend does her own artwork and she's told me, she's like, everyone has their own style and t and until you learn what your style is or develop how your thing is, everyone's thing is different. Yes. You know, the, also the funny thing too is that normally uh, with an artist, their characters semi look like themselves. Oh, really? Like they, have, they have feature, like characteristic, like features like their facial features are usually emulated through their artwork it's oh actually really interesting that's cool now um now i know you told me this off screen but no tell me tell me tell so the audience knows so tell them what is the one thing that you've done what is the one thing that really has been noticed about your artwork the biggest thing was a few months ago i got noticed by blizzard and they hosted my artwork on their social media site that's awesome, and and I believe that you were in Cosmo. I believe you were in Cosmo, and then yet there was a photograph, or no? Yes, it was my wedding. I had awesome. my wedding hosted in Cosmo um, because the World of Warcraft movie was coming out, and they were looking for couples that had met in WoW. And I am a big enough dork that I had a World of Warcraft themed wedding. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> But yes. And I designed, I designed everything, I made everything for my wedding, and everything had little bits and pieces of World of Warcraft in it. Now, I just had to ask, I just had to ask, because you probably know about this, in, during, your, during the wedding, did you guys, did, did, did your husband, or not your husband now, did he have cufflinks with a W on it? No, he did not, but he did have a horde tie. And our vows um, said in full, full health bars and res sickness. Nice. Those were our vows. <laughs> nice. So, um, so, like, did you guys have the whole, like, uh, wedding party in, like, the Nordic and the, the Horde themes or something? Um, we actually did both themes. Um, my husband is a Horde at heart, and I am an alliance at heart. And so, my, my side of the family and all that was alliance, and all of his side of the family was. Ah, I see. Our house is a little contentious right now because of battle for Azeroth. And also, I heard that uh, on the X bus, they're going to be trying to get WoW on there somehow. Oh, that would be neat. That's what I heard. I don't know if it's true, but no. Guys, don't believe me. Trust me. It's not canon. <laughs> Anything I say, because trust me, my girlfriend has let me know. 
I am an idiot, and I will stand by that. And every morning, I wake up to morning, and then I'm like, yay, I'm going to get the trash. And then she, go, um, she goes, why? And I'm like, because I am an idiot. <laughs> but anyways, guys, so um, so I was just going to say, like, um, so do you have any advice for my, my, my audience out there? The biggest thing is you need to love what you do. When you do your art, you need to do it for yourself, and you need to enjoy what you're doing. And practice, practice, practice. Even if you don't like something, still continue on, keep doing it, and you'll eventually get to a point in your life that you're, you're just loving what you're doing. Yeah, because, or, 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 or you get to that point where if there's something that you don't love to do, uh, don't love to do, and after a while you just keep on doing it, keep on doing it, you know you're not going to like it, hey, you don't got to yeah, stick with that. Then, then just stop. Then you can stop doing it. But it's always being willing to being open to doing yeah. things. Yeah, it's always it's always good to try new things. Yes, yes, that is true. Now, I'll have to ask you because this is a dumb question, but I'll say, okay, out of all the lovely, all the lovely, um, um, what was it, heroes from. From Lord of the Rings, uh, from Wow, sorry, not Lord of the Rings. <laughs> I would have got a lot of hate mail for that, but I'll say, um, for Wow, who is your favorite hero? Uh, can she be a villain? <laughs> I guess so. Queen Ajara, hands down. Well, it's kind of between Queen Ajara and Bolvar. Those are my two favorites. Okay, my favorite, and I'll say this, I'm not a real WoW person, but I'll say that I love a way back to, like, the uh, Reign of Chaos, but I'll say, Murder and Burns Beard! Yes, I would pillage your lids, steal your legs, and break our crutches with my hammers! Yes, yeah, all that lovely shit. Actually, they weren't hammers, they were axes, never mind. <laughs> I don't know my shit. <laughs> but still, I love, the, I love the dwarf. Never mess with it, nobody toss a dwarf. <laughs> and that was that was mind you a reference from Lord of the Rings. So I'm not sure where I'm going with that, but yeah, yeah. Oh, you're fine. It worked. It worked. It worked. I'm gonna get hate mail later, but it worked. It worked. But yes. Oh, thank you, Lilia, for being on the show. No problem. Thank you for having me. So what, guys? So you know what, guys? Please, please download in the description below because I'm actually gonna pin Lilia's. Twitch channel and her Twitter in the in the description below. And guys, like I always say, you know. No, I don't have Donny Pacelli in my living room. But anyways, guys, so please, please, please hit that like button because I like bacon. You like bacon. We all like bacon. Now, Peter, step I like off. bacon. Yeah, you love bacon. Oh, my God. That's awesome. We got someone else here that loves bacon. Shit, she loves bacon. Anyway, guys, please, you know what? Please, I'm Canadian. My girlfriend knows this, like everyone. If I don't get my bacon, I'm not pretty. And I'll say this. Please don't ask my girlfriend anything because... She probably says I'm not pretty in the morning. Anyways, so guys, please, please hit that notification bell so you stay up to date to all of my new videos. And I'll see you guys next time, guys. See you guys!